Hi, I'm Alex, and this is the new M motor steering system I worked out. Um, it's an RC car. Um, this is it working. Quick, you can see it. The rubber band. Basically, what this is is it's the normal rubber band system you see a lot, except it's all mounted. It's mounted after. It's mounted after the. Um, steering column instead of before and that's the problem I had um so there you go um so then we have two L motors for drive almost and then I'm gonna hand the camera to my mom here and we can test it so it's actually quite fast Steering works really well. And this is basically the first RC car I've made in like two months because I can't, I haven't figured out a good way to do the steering, return to center steering. And this works really well. Um, so yeah. Um, one more thing I'd like to show is is I'm actually going to take off the battery box and so you can get a better view which battery box and the IR controller are all together so this is okay so as you can see there's a lot of pieces on it but there's the M motor and then it goes through, it goes through the, the steering rack. And then you have this system. So this system is like the limiting system, basically, in the return to center part. Now this piece will return back to the center, and that acts throughout the whole axle. So it means the, all this will... Oh crap, just a second. I just had to hook the battery box back up, so you should be able to see it now. So, you can see that it turns, and you can also see this front piece turning with it, and that will stop the axle. And then I also have a these white pieces down here. This will stop it from oversteering, basically. They act as limiters when it turns. That is all I've got for today. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.